Hi everyone. Today I'm making for you tiramisu. It's not hard and you don't have to cook it. It goes right in the refrigerator and it's delicious. Some people don't care for it too much, but hey, it's a wonderful Italian dessert. Now what I have here is a half a cup of white sugar and two cold egg yolks. I have a cup of espresso, some vanilla, cocoa, mascarpone, lady fingers, and I have chilling in the refrigerator, a cup of whipped heavy cream. So what I'm gonna do is, into the espresso, I'm gonna put a tablespoon of cocoa and a tablespoon of vanilla and a, tea, a tablespoon and a half of rum. You don't have to put the rum in if you don't want. You can use whatever kind of liqueur you like, uh, Bailey's uh, cream or, uh, uh, what is that other one? Uh, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna put that in, into the mixture here. Gonna mix it up, get it dissolved really well get the cocoa dissolved some people don't put the cocoa in the coffee either or you don't have to if you don't want to but it gives it a little extra zing and so what i'm going to do after i mix it well is i'm going to put it in this bowl because it's flat in the meantime the sugar and the egg yolks i'm going to beat with the beat, the hand beater, you could use a big mixer or whatever. And I'm going to beat it until it comes to a pale yellow, a fluffy pale yellow. And I'll be back when it's done. So I beat the egg and the sugar, the egg yolk and the sugar for about five minutes. That's the color it should be, like a pale yellow. And I have here eight ounces of mascarpone and about a cup, a cup and a half of whipped cream. I'm gonna blend them together. Let me get this mascarpone out and I'm gonna take the egg yolk and sugar and add it into the heavy cream. Just gonna mix it until it's uh, incorporated. Okay, so this is the coffee, the vanilla, the rum, and the cocoa. We're gonna take the lady fingers, dip them in the coffee mixture, and lay them on the bottom of the uh, dish, the baking dish. Like I said before, you don't uh, bake this, you just put it in the refrigerator. My family, you know, my aunts, none of them were bakers. I don't know why. But I guess because there was a lot of pastry shops in the area, in East Harlem, there was like a bakery on every other block. There was DeRosa's on 116 between First and Pleasant. There was Sincati on uh, 116 and Second Avenue in the corner. And then there was one on 117 First Avenue, 121st. They were all over, so I guess they didn't have to bake. <laughs> oh, they were big on uh, pastries. So, yeah, big on pastries, that's for sure. I remember my Aunt Margie. They were, and, and it's strange because they were sweet lovers. They, could, they loved their sweets. Let me tell you, my mother, every night, she had a cup of coffee and a pastry or something sweet. She used to send me down the block, go to Sincati's, get me some cheesecake, go to DeRosa's, get me this, go on 21st and get me this pastry. Uh, each one had her special, had their specialties that she uh, made me go get. And then she'd have it at night with her cup of coffee, sitting by the window, watching everybody on the avenue. 
So what I'm gonna do now is take this cream and put the first layer Ah, and spread it. Whoa, that's going to fall off. Now we take the second layer. I'll be back when I'm done doing this. So I did the, the top layer and I'm going to put the rest of the the cream on top. There we go, we get it all. All right, so what you do is, you take about another tablespoon of cocoa and you put it on top. You could also put chocolate curls if you want but I find this is easier. You put this in the fridge for at least three, three hours, preferably overnight to get it, to get it uh, really chilled. I want to get the edges. Okay, so there's a tiramisu. I have a cover for this. And if you want to make it for the holidays and you can't, you know, you can chill it or freeze it and then defrost it overnight. So I'm going to put the cover on and put it in the refrigerator. And I hope you enjoy this recipe. It's very simple, isn't it? Until next time.